Hi, my name is Ryan DeAngelis here at the Guarantee RV Supercenter. I'm going to show you a trailer today that's one of our most popular for bunkhouses. So it's about 26 feet, not counting the bumper and the hitch and all the other stuff that sticks out. It weighs under 6,000 pounds. It's a Jayco 2019 J Flight. It's a 267 BHSW, so it's a bunkhouse with a slide. So up front, right off the bat, you can see this one has a little bit bigger propane bottles on it and a power tongue jack. You have a Rocky Mountain Edition package on it. You used to have to go up to the Baja package to get the bigger water tanks. I carry this model in Baja and non-Baja. This one is a Baja, so you'll see the bigger off-road tires on the outside, and it's got flipped axles, but you don't have to go to Baja like you have for many, many years to get the bigger water tanks. So this gives you a 40-gallon freshwater tank with an additional 40-gallon freshwater tank. You have 80 gallons of fresh water, which is a ton for a trailer this size. You got a full pass-through up front, a ton of storage underneath that's usually lacking in most trailers, and that gives you a little bit more than, than most trailers do. The Baja Edition gives you a little bit extra diamond plate too. It sits up a little bit higher because it's got bigger off-road tires, and like I said, they flip the axles as well for a little more clearance. But your Rocky Mountain package gives you a couple extra things, and I'll show you that on the inside when we get in there. You get an additional outdoor storage. Usually, if you've been looking at trailers, you get one pass-through up in the front, and that's what you got. The rest of your stuff is going either inside or in your truck. So this gives you an additional storage from the accessible from the outside that you can also get into from that bottom bunk on the inside, because that's right below the, the bottom bunk there. So here, I'm going to show you some stuff on the inside. All right, right off the bat, you got your entertainment system when you walk in. That's a 32-inch Furion TV that pulls out and swivels, so no matter where you're sitting in here, you can see it. AM, FM, CD, DVD with Bluetooth, all the good stuff there. You got a uh, bed up front. It's a queen that you can get out and in from either side, so nobody has to crawl over anybody in the middle of the night to get out. Plugs on both sides of the bed, closets, air conditioning is pumped back here. You have a TV mount on the side here. If you want to put a bedroom TV in, you can do that too. Now you have a sofa that folds out into a full height of bed. A lot of these uh, units that have a couch that turns into another bed, a lot of times it's a jackknife and it makes a bed that's good enough for a kid or something like that, but not real adults. This folds all the way out to a good size height of bed. It's a tri-fold sofa. You could fit two adults comfortably in it. Then you have your dinette that can always break down too. Now it's a little bit bigger of a, a boot for a booth style than most where you could fit two people comfortably in there uh, or even three kids if you have to. This is a 2019 model, so one of the biggest changes they made from last year to this year was they put the solid surface countertops in the Jayco's now in 2019. So there's no T molding, it's all one solid piece now. Split sinks with an extendable sprayer. You got full kitchen here, you got your uh, black blinds in the kitchen and black shades in all the windows. So not a lot of light gets in here. If you want to darken it up, you can do that pretty easily. Everybody else is kind of still using tan. You have an oven, three burners, microwave. Now this is one of the things that's different. This comes in a Rocky Mountain package. This is an eight cubic foot fridge. Almost every trailer I carry out here, it's kind of always the industry standard to have a six cubic foot fridge in the bigger stuff and even smaller, like a four cubic foot in your small trailers. This is an eight cubic foot fridge. It's two cubic feet bigger than almost everything I carry out here, which is pretty cool. Then you have a very large closet pantry. It's got floating shelves. It has a rod in it. You can kind of do what you need to do with it, whatever you need more space for and some additional space up top. Now you have bunks in the back. They're the bigger bunks, they're a little bit wider, so you can fit two kids in there, or bigger kids, or adults you can crawl in there too, and it's pretty easy to get to. Both have a window, uh, both have plugs. Now in the back here, you got a bathroom. They separate a little bit on this one to save on length, but it's also nice where somebody can be using the bathroom or taking a shower, someone else can be brushing their teeth or getting ready. So you got a toilet and a tub in here. That's a porcelain toilet, which is also part of the Rocky Mountain package. So you get actually a real toilet instead of a cheap plastic one, which is kind of nice and kind of rare in trailers. So wide open floor plan here, plenty of room for people to sleep. If you, want, if you need additional beds after that, it's got those too. Uh, follow me, I'm gonna show you some more stuff on the outside. All right, so all the lights on the inside are LED lights, and that's pretty common now for the last couple years. But on a Jayco like this, also, the outside lights are all LED. So sometimes you don't always notice that because they're covered with colored lenses, but this actually has LED lights on the inside and the outside. That's not always the norm. So you got a LED light strip and your power awning as well. So while you're camping out underneath the awning, you can have a little bit of light to see your steps and kind of hang out even after it gets dark a little bit. 
Now this is different here too. You don't see this much anymore in this industry, but it is kind of a nice thing, even if you don't use it, to know that you can. It's a full walk-on roof. It has a ladder. You can get up there and walk around. Jayco's are known for having some of the strongest roofs in the industry. Jayco's been around for 50 years, and it's the number one selling travel trailer in the United States since 2005. So there's something to that. When you're looking in this price range, it's built much, much better for the other stuff that's typically priced around 20 something thousand dollars. A lot of that stuff is kind of on the chintzier side. A Jayco is a nice, solid unit it with a good name and the best warranty in the industry. You got a full size spare on the back and you also have a short cord that pops out on this side too. So your cord actually stays in so you don't have to roll it up and shove it in your outside compartments taking up your storage there. Uh, another thing that's a little bit different, whether you go Baja or non-Baja, all Jayco's have made in the U.S. Goodyear tires on them. They've been doing that for a couple years now at least. So made in the U.S. Goodyear tires, these are the off-road Baja ones, but you also get that with the regular non-Baja as well. You got solar prep up on the front. You can actually plug a solar panel into this. It's wired for it if you buy a solar panel. One of the briefcase ones that you can plug in. Nice big slide on this back side. And then all your hookups. Your dumps are easy to get to. There's one pipe, two tabs, one for your gray, one for your black. You have an outdoor shower over here as well. Sometimes that's missing on certain trailers. Black tank flush, so you can hook fresh water up and flush the black tank. But everything's all in one central area and it's easy to get to. There's a bunch more stuff on here I'd like to show you, so shoot me a call when you get a chance. My number is 541-525-4001. We can set up a time for you to come in so I can show you some more and some other stuff like it. Give me a call when you can. Talk to you soon.